Hi guys, welcome back to another video. In the previous video, I talked about how we can open long and short positions in Binance using Python. In this video, we'll talk about how we can open long and short positions with a stop loss function so that when we open the positions, we also put the stop loss at the same time. So let's go ahead and get started. So first of all, I'll write code to define the function which can be used to put stop loss in the long direction stop loss for long trade so first of all i'll define the function now because we are trading in one way mode so i'll put one way here and i'll put long because this stop loss is for trade in the in long direction and i'll put stop loss Now in the function, I'll put client dot futures underscore create order and here I'll write the symbol. In our case, the symbol is SYM. Then I'll put the side and because this is stop loss for long trade, so I'll put sell here because when stop loss is hit, it will sell. And I'll put a flag here, which is close position. And that has to be equal to true. And we'll put stop price equals price and then i'll put the type here which will be stop market in our case now within the function we'll define client and the symbol and the price at which we want to tr trigger the stop loss now if we run this code and let's try to open the long trade and also call the function to put stop loss. Now you can see here that we haven't defined the price. So we will define the price at which we want to trigger the stop loss. And I'll put the price as 6 because we are trading in DOT and the current price of DOT is 6.25. Please note that the stop loss price for long trade should be less than the current price. Otherwise, this order will not trigger and you'll get an error. Now, if we run the code, the code has successfully run and it has opened a long trade and put a stop loss order as well. Now let's repeat the same process for short trade. So I'll copy this function and I'll make changes to it. It is for short trade. And I'll change the function and put short here. I'll change the side to buy. And this should be working for us. So if I run this code, And I'll call function to put stop loss. One thing to remember for this is because this time we are opening a short trade, so our price should be greater than the current price. So I'll put price equals 6.6. .6. And if I run the code, we can see that the code has successfully run and it has opened a short trade and it has also put a short stop loss order. So that's it for today. In the next video, I'll talk about the next steps of the future trading using Python in Binance. I'll put the link of this code in the description in case you want to make use of it. If you face any issues, please write them in the comment section and I'll respond to your comments. Please subscribe to my channel for further updates. Have a good day.